Hey everybody, welcome to the Gamer Dad Buds as we react to the PlayStation Showcase. Yeah, so this is a bit of a different uh, thing what we have been doing, um, but we um, hope that you'll enjoy it, because uh, I haven't seen anything from PlayStation uh, thing yet, so hopefully it's... Uh, there's good stuff. Uh, yeah. I don't know what all they show. I've been avoiding it like the plague so we could react to it <laughs> okay. and so we could see together with yeah. eyes clouded I mean, clearly by it's hate. Only, it's only two, we're only two days late. It was, it was out on Wednesday, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we're, we're only two days I late. I had no idea it even dropped. Otherwise, we would have did it that day. I but... mean, I think it's the I think it's the rounds. Everybody's going to start doing stuff. But let's go ahead and start it. Yeah, let's go ahead and dive right in. Fucking, so yeah, no, I'm, I'm not a PlayStation. I don't, have, I don't have any of the consoles right now except for the Switch. Um, it's like, what are you anticipating as a PlayStation person? Um, just kind of wanting them to show some games I haven't really touched on in a while. Yeah. Uh, maybe even some games that I'm looking forward to personally. So, like, I want them to surprise us as well. Yeah, I mean, uh, surprises are always fun. Yeah, so. no, surprises are always fun. It's just that PlayStation also usually aren't too good at surprises. Yeah. Like, they usually stick into, like, the meat and potatoes of the showcase. Like, things they already announced, things that they have like, running. I feel like if you want surprises, you go to Xbox, because they just announce random shit. Yeah, Xbox or Nintendo. Nintendo has gotten a little bit more surprising with their directs, so... That's true. PlayStation Studios already. Haven? Haven is a team... They've done some other things, right? Mmm... That's a code for something. You can type that into a website, I'm you sure. You want to know about us? Sure. Seems like everyone does these days. Cheat the rich. All right. It's simple. Mickey Mouse, old cartoons, Olive, Popeye, too Billionaires. Too much power was held by just a few people. Elliot Moore, fuck that guy. Yeah, Pam I is guess. only getting worse. Oh no, it's liberalism so, the game. <laughs> to do about it. No. Sure Robin it's... Hood. I mean, they had a Robin Hood game. Oh, I didn't. It was okay. It wasn't crossplay. Was really or had crossed the, the way it worked with me. Okay. So I like I saw a crew like three or four, I was about to say. But this looks newer. This looks like a new IP. This looks like a... It's heist based and shit like that, right? Yeah. So it's, it's, I was gonna say like hit payday, a new payday, but then I was like, these are chillers. No, this looks like, uh, what's that game? Called uh, the finals. Mm. That's what I'm getting. Some mad payday slash finals. Lives. The finals is like a three v a three v three like for a three team of a bunch of other teams, and you like fight for objectives and money. Got you. Um, and that's what fair games. Yeah. Trademark. Take it till you make it. That's actually a pretty good tagline. I'm not gonna lie. That is. That is pretty good. So it's it's robbers. Yeah. Robbers the game. Damn, I forgot PlayStation. I was about to say, wish we saw gameplay, but that's not something. That, that's not something you get with PlayStation. Nah, is that, so is, is that a PlayStation exclusive? That's the question. It was is PlayStation it? Studios. Oh, was so it I'd imagine it is. Hi, yeah. I'm Jim Ryan. President, I was say, Ga CEO Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> he does kind of look like Gordon Ramsay, doesn't he? Hey, they say that you know on the planet the there's like everybody has at least six doppelgangers. Oh yeah, cycle of PS5. yeah. Can be We've male or female. So many. So you know, if you like yourself like that, I mean, I'm what's sure even more does. exciting is that developers <laughs> you like might just actually be able to fight me. Finally, after everybody telling me to do so, today you'll get a glimpse into some of the most breathtaking, worthy opponent content that will be coming to. Imagine it was Our a session bit of will be legendary. Oh, is, it, is it pixelated? Now, it might be a little low. No, it's all HD. Been waiting for. Is that just the Enjoy video the itself? It might be, honestly. It, it's 1080p. Yeah, it's yeah. saying it's running 1080p, 60. That. All right, that video was just really pixelated for no reason then. Yeah. Uh, PlayStation yeah. Studios. Super Earth. Super Our Earth. Our home. The Sims Our 6. It. Seven. Nine. Doesn't come free. <laughs> oh. You just gonna watch that? <laughs> Oh, okay. I mean, is that, is that what we're doing? <laughs> Look familiar? No. no. <laughs> Scenes like this are happening all over the galaxy right now. Sorry if y'all heard that thump. That was next. my ween. That is, unless you. <laughs> that was my jaw dropping from the absolute just of your <laughs> shock of the video. Prove to yourself. Okay. I lied to y'all. It's small. Halo. Be free. Hell no. Join the Hell Divers. 
Did he just say Halo Divers? He said Hell Divers, I thought. Hell Divers, okay. I was gonna say, this just looks like Halo, but Destiny. What the fuck? Arrowhead Studios. Experience true freedom. Is this shock? Is this, is this uh, base freedom to travel the galaxy? Yeah. And secure the resources we need to build a better tomorrow. The freedom to encounter fascinating life forms. Mm. And well, to be honest, this looks really generic. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to say, this looks like everything the that I've seen ever. New <laughs> this looks like EDF. If EDF had a baby with Destiny, and the, the baby was not Destiny's. <laughs> It was not his. And yeah. work together. It looks like a to free to play game. Prosperity. Liberty. I think that's the and only way anybody would see. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is not look. This does look. not look like a sixty dollar game. Of no. Larger than yourself. Like that looks like a Halo helmet. Yeah. It looks like a Halo armor and like Become like it's like a, a mix of Destiny and Halo Become design. Enlist today. Maybe it is free to play. If it's free to play, that'd be dope. Helldivers 2. Hell diver may result in PS5 and PC 2023. Okay. Final Hell Diver Survive. Interesting. Yeah, that, I don't know how to feel about that one. That one didn't look that great. No. Oh. The first game looked interesting. That one looks, again, like everything I've seen. <laughs> it in the looks past like a free to play. <laughs> well, y'all know what to do. Yes, Unless y'all don't. Okay. I read that as Accident Studios. Accident. And I was like, hey. EA Originals. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. <laughs> uh -oh. Maybe engage a little. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, hold on. We got spell, spell FPS. Do spell FPS? Hey, I mean. Okay, this this looks good so far. I'm kind of digging it. I'm not gonna lie to you. No, no, it's piquing my interest. Yeah, this just is... a little bit. Buff lady, I'm sold. Jury's still out on that one. I mean, you had me at Doom FPS with spell. Yeah. No, like, that's a good call. That's like Battle Mage Central, bro. That's like everything I'd want to play in an FPS. Just really gotta. Oh man, and a butt plug. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> gotta hope that the name of this game is not stupid. <laughs> I just, oh, it's gonna be. Boy. It's gonna be. Uh, that is peaking my interest. Oh, he looks kind of cool. <laughs> is it a Dark Souls boss? This Doom's game. This Doom game is a Dark Souls boss. We haven't given them enough yet. Yo. No way, Doctor Fate. <laughs> I can see the meme at it now. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of people's families die, kid, get in line. Yeah. So far, the characters and the story seem generic, but the environments and the gameplay was really good. Still a little sluggish for my take though. Yeah. Just a little bit. Movement speed, maybe there's something that they'll they'll compensate for that, but it could be just trailer things. Immortals of Avon. That looks interesting. Okay. Not gameplay, a stupid name. Not too bad. Yeah, gameplay looks good. I don't know how the story... Like, Certainly wouldn't pre-order now. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 that, the, the characters felt like something out of Force Spoken. Yeah. 505. Okay, I know 505. I know of them. <clears throat> one more level. Okay. One more, one more. Every time I have to get on off, off the computer. Yeah. One more level, please. Okay. He's committing suicide. That's fantastic. Oh, it's a fucking um, samurai game. Samurai feature game. Um, ghost something, I think. Ghost Warrior? No, Ghost Runner? Ghost Runner. Oh, yeah. No, I think you're right. Ghost Runner. Looks like you have, you have a motorcycle now, so now it is Ghost Rider. Yeah! Ghost Runner 2. That looks good. Uh oh. Blood will run. Okay. Okie dokie. I think that's a multi plat, though. Yeah, I remember the first one being What's a little. Your plan? Or at least on PC. Knowing you have only 66 days to live. 
66 days to the S game. You're... Alright, that's a lot to claim. Neo, three. I wish. Wolong, Long, Fallen Dynasty, two. Just... Running. Metal Gear Rising. <laughs> Revengeance. Oh my god, he does clear. Wait! <laughs> oh, bro, my heart just dropped for a second. I was like, what? <laughs> my ass literally got spooked by that. Wait a minute. Okay. <clears throat> we have Asian girl. We have man with thunder spear. Dog. Dog. <laughs> Men on horseback with no faces. So they got they got the what's the things from Harry Potter? The Dementors. I was gonna say we they got, got Chinese Dementor. <laughs> they got birdoed. <clears throat> okay. Everyone wears a mask. You too. This is a real face. I'm getting mad. Like shadow you know, runner or shadow. What secret um, did you sell them? Okay. Oh. Okay. okay. All right. That's looking slick if that's... Um, if I'm being a little honest... I'm a little horny. It looks good, but I feel like it's going to play very good. Probably. Like, this looks like... like I, These set pieces look like they're set up to be... For the trailer. Yeah. But I feel like actual gameplay is going to be nowhere as clean. The only way I can figure gameplay working out like the way they just showed is if it kind of functions uh, similar to, like, Arkham. The Arkham yeah. Games combat. Yeah. This looks like it's gonna be very like press one button to win kind of focus. Which you know what? I'd never really oh, mind that uh, gameplay. Yeah. Honestly, as as a Dynasty oh, Warriors oh. fan. Oh no, yeah. <laughs> so I don't mind if it looks cool oh. enough. As long as the set pieces are interesting. <laughs> He's doing the flippies and the dippies, my guy. Sure. Look, the Chinese Dementors. Although. These look like quick time events. <laughs> yeah, those look like mad quick time events. And I, I, I'm hoping that all the cool things that you can do is not tied only to quick time events. That'd be mighty unfortunate. Yeah. But yeah, this looks very Arkham gameplay. Which again, I don't mind personally. Not terrible, but I mean, it's just I don't know. Yeah. Hopefully, there's a bit more depth. Is the key. Buddha, what are you doing here? Time is not on his side. All <clears throat> we have to do is wait. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> he agrees. <laughs> That's an ornate sword. That's an ornate sword. Phantom Blade Zero. Wow, they're a bold. What's Man. your plan? That's a generic name. No it is very generic, except for the zero part. <laughs> Even that's generic. I feel like there's a ghost blade out there. Ghost Get blade my zero. Heart back. Mm. It's got bonfires. It's Dark Souls. That piques my interest even more. Mix Arkham and Dark Souls. I mean, hey, I'm, I'm down for that. Huh. That's sand, okay, that's not water. I thought that was water. Yeah, no. Journey 2? The West? No, Journey. Like the yeah, no. <laughs> PS3 game? Yeah! Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Is that man riding a sword? <laughs> this man surfing sand waves on a fucking sword. Okay, you have my attention. You have my attention. <laughs> You're Let's right. That's, go. A, that's a great idea. <laughs> Yo! Okay. I this don't looks really nice. Yeah. I mean, all the games that this company makes look very pretty. Yeah. <laughs> what civilization out there is like, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna make weapons that we can skateboard and we're gonna have sick half pipes everywhere. Ah, uh, the same civilization that, like, Sonic is from. It's the know. civilization where Tony Hawk took over. <laughs> It's the simulation where Tony Hawk was recognized without the skateboard. Sword of the Sea. Okay. Okay. Nice. I'm interested. I'm down to skateboard on sand with a sword. Ooh, I, I hate this shit. I hate when people do this. 
They do have like a lot of dramatic transitions. For no fucking reason. So like, get on to the next thing, please. I feel like Nintendo nails it with the direct. Yeah, because it's just quick. It's a quick transition, and they even show what's coming up next. And mysteries. When they do it, because it's just Signs, time. Holy shit, I robot. Where's Will Smith? Things that I in my <laughs> could never have imagined. Okay. Think of the world we could build if we believed in ourselves. If we truly believed in what it means to be sentient. He gets ridiculed enough. Yeah, he does. To face the universe without fear or delusion. Constantly. And it airs all out. All I gotta say is wouldn't be. That's how I'm gonna just leave it at that. I said, what? I said, all I gotta say is, wouldn't be me. Oh, no, yeah. towards the sky. Oh, yeah. So much would be possible. Mr. Crow, I don't think you're supposed to be doing that. If we believed. If we still had faith. Is that what the game is called? Oh, the Talos Principle 2. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Damn, you know, it's really hard to feel about most of these games when they're just trailers. <laughs> yeah. And not, you know, gameplay. Did the bird die midair? That would have been tragic. Stack them on Oh, the from the Craters of Grist, okay. Oh. I, le I haven't played that yet, but I want to. What is happening? Ooh, rest in peace. What the fuck? See, I'll just watch that happen. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. Oh, God. They're... <laughs> oh, no. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. The darkness is coming. You have to run. It's the plot of Moana. What? You don't remember? The darkness is taking over the oceans. People were dying. No. Killing all the fish. Uh, the wolf campaign is getting murky though. Jesus. Yeah, GG's. Alright, you are not Shulk Xenoblade Chronicle. It was all a dream. I imagined it. I it guess not. Real. Never mind. Dude. Can't kill off the companion. You just wet its nose, it's good. <laughs> yeah, it'll wake up. <laughs> what is it with games having animal companions that die? Because they know that people love animals more than people. You gotta have that connection. Look, the little one's still there. Yeah, how did that happen? It was too cute. Like, you would think the little one would be the one that got absolutely murked. Yeah. Like this video I saw earlier. This art style is very beautiful. No, it is. I'm in love with it. <laughs> Puppy. <Bro>. <laughs> <laughs> Never. More like never made it because the wolf died. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> I don't know. Cat. We've gone from we've gone from like super artistic art style to like chibi cat animation. Cat, cat quest. quest. Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Caribbean. I'm down. Yeah. Yo, what the fuck? He just saw lightning. Look, I'm down with the puns. I'm 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 very much a man that can laugh at almost anything. So, Cat Sparrow. I hate cats, but that Cat <laughs> that that tight title almost got me. This looks interesting. I like it. It does. It looks like a like fun, like a dumb fun type of game. Where you can just kind of turn your brain off and just yeah play. Uh oh, here's big budget game. It's got serious. Square Enix. Oh no, is this Final Fantasy 6 time? I doubt it. Man's got a chain gun and an overly long cape. Yeah, there is no way that. Arms <laughs> too! No. Um. <laughs> is this a 3v3? It's looking like it. Oh, uh, they got cute girls and multicolored hair. Okay. It's a showtime! Snake. Alright. 
bubbles. Why does this look like this slice? It's a bubble <laughs> game. Like, they're shooting bubbles? And I guess we'll Champagne. sodas. Okay. More bubbles. Okay. Is this gonna be like Splatoon where you gotta soak the most area? Oh my god, it is a Splatoon, isn't it? It could be. It is. They it's, got surfboards It's Overwatch and shit. Splatoon. Hey, as long as Blizzard's not in it's control. It's Overwatch Splatoon. I oh mean, my fucking god. Hey. <laughs> look, if it's good, it's good. But yeah. It's well, really... look, Nintendo is not the first to do the turf war thing. It's true, but, but. <laughs> Nintendo has in... arguably done it the best. In forms of colorful liquid. <laughs> Although this one seems like you can elevate things, which seems a bit more interesting. Yeah, you can literally build your own and scaffolding. it's literally like Overwatch meets Splatoon. So you have specific characters and abilities. I don't know, I kind of vibe with it, honestly. It's I mean, that, it's genuinely? That, it's got that funky... Foam star party? Do not tell me it's called Foam Stars. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Oh man! Oh, this looks absolutely Welcome charming. Oh yo! Oh, it's a storybook RPG John. game. Ah, uh, this is a frame one for me. Yeah, this is cute. I'm a fucking sucker for art style in in all this type of stuff. It's like a Zelda. Yeah, nah, this is. Oh, bro. They adventure to the edges of their realm and even yo beyond. A link between worlds, you bastard. There, Jot finds a whole new world to explore with dangers. Yeah, this surprises. is frame one for me, dude. Yeah, this looks fun. This is nice. This looks absolutely fun. Our like heroes adorable. must battle Humdrum across the two realms if they are to save their <clears throat> beloved land from his diabolical. RPG design. battles? Excuse me? Off the page and into adventure. Yo. Yo, this is some charming shit. I haven't seen. Devolver. That, that makes sense. That, yeah, Devolver that's a, that's Digital. definitely Devolver. Devolver's such a good publisher, dude. They're amazing. I fucking love Devolver Digital. What do we need to sponsor by Devolver? Sponsor us. Please. We love y'all. Please. Oh, tear, tear, tear away. Tear down? Tear something. Tear the dick. It's a game where literally the whole game, it's the opposite of uh, the washing game. Yeah. You break things. The whole point of the game is to just destroy everything. That sounds fantastic. It's it looks it, like it's like the power washing game. Yeah. Oh yeah. Do you have the ability to like take over Godzilla and just kind of cause <laughs> citywide? I don't know. I don't know much about the game. I've seen it played once, and it looks fun. <laughs> I love when games just have you do dumb fun stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, no, this is this is Just stupid. have a shotgun? Stupid for the sake of stupid. Yeah, it's lovable though. Where did, where did man go? I like it. Yeah. You get to graffiti? Why would you need a graffiti? Well, I is guess there... to give you myself like demolition is there instructions. Tear down, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. I mean, that's one way to do it. Yeah. It looked like from that, uh, who was that? From The Incredibles. Frozone, his house. <laughs> Remember that scene? Woman! Honey! Where's, where's my, my super soup? <laughs> Bugs. Bug. Bug game. Very high def bug. It's grounded. They're just copying grounded by Xbox. Have you heard of that? Mm mm. It's like a game. It's like Honey, Honey I Shrunk the Kids, the game. Mm. Your four kids who were shrunken down by a science experiment in a dude's backyard. 
need to fight bugs. Damn. Oh, okay. Snatch the whole Thanksgiving. They were gonna be set for five. Bugs. <laughs> what is happening? Is there a burb? What? No. What is this? <clears throat> that gate was there for a reason. Something, something crazy is about to fucking pop up. Uh, um, dinosaur. Ooh, that's, that's a snake. I don't like those. That's a crocodile. They, 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 they beefing. They are, they are beefing. They are going at each other. Bro, imagine they zoom into this fucking forest and you just start hearing like, what a thrill. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> With darkness and silence in the night. Wait! Fuck! Wait, really? No way. Hold on! No way. Yo! Ah! <clears throat> ah! <laughs> oh my god! There's no way. There's no way. Ah! No way! <laughs> Uh oh. Oh, you got a little one. Oh, <laughs> Metal Girl Snake Eater! A remake? Oh my god! My daughter, hold on, hold on, I gotta get my daughter. Pause. Come here, baby. She heard you scream. She heard you scream. She had to come check up on you. Bro. Sorry! We'll cut back now. <laughs> that, that just caught me off guard. I just <laughs> literally I had to go get my daughter. So it's it's gonna be a Metal Gear remake without Hideo. Really? I mean, I would assume. Why would y'all do that? Oh, Master Collection. Okay. I can't breathe. <laughs> <laughs> It went from zero to 100 real quick, and I'm dizzy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I did. <clears throat> Dehydrated. Agashba. Oh, is that underwater? He's spitting. I hope this is some made-up language. Otherwise, I will feel very, very bad for that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Because he said, Bogo. <laughs> it's it's Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> Minecraft. <sighs> oh, I thought he died. Yeah, I was gonna say, damn, that <laughs> happened quick. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it, but, it, excuse me. Sorry, there's no way this game is coming out looking this good. <laughs> Hate to break it to y'all. And if it does look this good, not gonna be running at 60. I mean, I'm getting some mad like Monster Hunter slash uh, Shadow of Glosses vibes. Yeah, no, this is giving me some serious Shadow of Glosses vibes and <clears throat> and Breath of the Wild Arms with the fucking paraglider. Towers of Agospa. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm down with it. <laughs> You know, I would actually catch a heart attack here and now if, like, Shadow of Colossus 2 was announced. Oh, my God. <laughs> you thought it was... Oh, here's Final Fantasy. Hey, this is what I would... a knife to their throats. You have to believe us. We'd help you if we could. Damn. <laughs> he said he would help you. <laughs> Got out of the way. <clears throat> he was like, helped us right. <clears throat> Yo, this game is about to be OD. They're gonna job. You better hope so. Crystals take more than they give. You mean to tell me that the mother crystals are the reason the world is dying? I can't believe it. What the hell are we talking? <clears throat> if they won't give us a say, we'll decide our fates another way. Are you with me? Hey, I'll watch you die. You Tell me true. Do you believe what I'm about to do is wrong? I was forced to kill. You do it by choice. They don't believe in me. 
They believe in the powers that dominant. I really thought it was gonna be to to I believe in the power believe in me that believes in me. <laughs> I thought it was gonna grow grow in Lagan that shit. <clears throat> and thus is the light of hope severed. We don't need your salvation. We'll save ourselves and we'll do it on our own terms. Come to me, Ifrit! Yeah, that line delivery. <clears throat> I don't know how I feel about it. Come to me, Ifrit! Admittedly, it could have been a little better. But so Final Fantasy bringing, games usually kind of have a... They're bringing back a rhythm. Oh my god. You Kaiju battle. battles, bro. Kaiju summon battles? Yeah, absolutely. Fucking what? That's what I thought. I was like, oh yeah. No, ever since I've heard there would be Kaiju battles in here, I was like... <laughs> Why isn't it out now? <laughs> I'm sorry, but Ifrit... Ifrit's strong, but he's not strong enough to fight somebody. Oh, absolutely, bro. If her kicks you in, will give me the strength to end your reign. Like, if I remember correctly, the, the strongest summon is if it's, if it's like Nifty. Right. We survive. We endure. We obviously bomb this. Hate a reason. Christian, he is him. He's main character now. He is him. <laughs> Look, man. I'm gonna say this right now. Mm -hmm. People are already sleeping on this game. I I think I think you miss out on this one. You you gon you gonna miss out on something special. As long as it's not like fifteen where it's just Backstreet Boys the game. Yeah, no. I don't think it's gonna be Backstreet Boys the game. If anything, that looked like it's kinda aiming more mature than what Final Fantasy normally goes for. It looked like it was going for more of a dirge of Cerberus type shit. Like fun like like er, like late Final Fantasy seven, like early Final Fantasy, like Yeah. But imagine remake if, like, four. Dirt you want to remake good. a good Final Fantasy? Remake four. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm trapped here in this nightmare. I write to escape. Outlook. Every word nah, bro, that's is a word. <laughs> I miss this. <laughs> My guy went to college. John Wick. Not the best choice. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. Anderson. The victim was one of their own. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. So you knew our victim? Only the rumors. Oh, is this um Alan Wake? Someone knew they what? were What? Was playing a game with them. Yeah, no, they announced uh, uh, it a long time ago, but they just gave, like, pretty much dropped the title. It's for us. They didn't show anything about the game. The text game. is about us. Yo. We were all trapped in a horror story. The horror story wanted us dead. Yo! Uh, this is looking pretty spiffy. Please tell me the, the, the classic combat's back. Oh! Fuck! Oh, oh shit! <laughs> I'm forgetting. Something important. Okay, they do have the shadow on them. Something's not right! Easy now. First things first. What's your name? Really? I don't like that. No? Just the, what's your name? <gasps> Title. <laughs> <laughs> it's PlayStation. You know they got a mimic move. Well, I mean, it's on Epic. It's Epic Games Publishment. Ass ass in Creed. Looks like a classic one too, like classic style. Welcome. So like everybody world. saw that. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Like you just you just walked up to a man, gave him a neck massage in the middle of the square. That's how everybody I'm saw that. I'm Sorry. Yeah, like you're not a good assassin. You're not too good at what you're supposed to okay, be. Okay, so doing. this is looking like old Assassin's Creed. Yeah. Back to form. I almost broke that woman's back, by the way. Oh, fuck that woman. Okay. That's a classic Assassin's Creed thing. We need thing. to find a way to get you inside without being seen. You could bribe the guards to look the other way. I shall see what flavor best suits me. You could talk to the guards and... And have them leave their post. Nah, I'm going to kill them. Yeah, I'm going to murder them. <laughs> Embrace the fear. Quiet it. 
find the stillness. And let's go. Multi take down. Is it's got burnt out. Yeah. And I don't know if this one will do it just yet. Are they still doing the whole, like, everything's a memory thing? Or is this, like, are they just done with that, like, concept? Got no clue. Like, I remember, like, the first three, it's like, oh, you're playing memories. Yeah. I, I got no clue. Oh! Finji! Finji getting stingy! <clears throat> the Glory Society. Flying on my rake. Yeah. There's just a skeleton there. Another one. Yeah. All right, we're popping. Witches. Um, people floating in trees. Like doctors. The industrial area. Riding. Guns. Uh, they are about to lay out that crowd. <laughs> see, Ma see, this problem has been around forever. Yeah. Don't you hate when the skeletons walk into Walmart? These damn bony bitches. <laughs> Revan and Hill. That so seems adorable. Yeah. Right. Looted. Okay. It's like, one of these things have never been that long. Yeah. Uh, this has got to be something. Side Psy games. games. Grand Blue. Oh. Oh, it's the uh, it's the RPG one, not the not the fighting game. Oh yeah, that is an RPG, isn't it? Is it like a free-to-play thing, or like what is it? I don't really remember. The, the, this thing has been in the works for so long <laughs> that I've what lost track of all what it's about. What was the original Grand Blue, then? Oh, the original Grand Blue was like an online um, uh, thingy. Like being a cool? Yeah, essentially. And yeah, this looks cool. No, it's looked cool for so long. Yeah. No, you do. I'll bring the mic to you. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah, it looks great. I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I'm feeling. Uh, it, it looks like a lot of custom character stuff. It doesn't look like a specific character. Well, no, like all these are characters so far. Oh, are they? Yeah. I don't know anything. Like about actual Randall. characters, so. I actually don't think I've heard anything custom character wise. Oh, wow. Use like pick characters, kind of set like a like a Monster Hunter deal. Oh, okay. Except for lacking the custom part. Hey, oh, it's hey. Street Fighter Six. Hey, let's see what we got. I, I thought they'd be done. I'm advertising for it. It's around the corner. I'm digging the, the kind of many during my journey for true strength. I'm digging the hip hop aesthetic of this game. Oh yeah, they definitely. Honed in back so, to the urban roots of it all. So this is like the generic, all. like my journey character no character from trailers. Yeah, yeah, he is what I your creative character down. will be doing in the world tour. This looks like just story stuff. When you yeah. said you were seeking strength, Lord have mercy no on me. To do so. Honestly, I thought you were a complete idiot. Well, there. Got my boy Bob talking. Masters, he was set up. I'm not nearly strong enough to chase after a monster like that. I like her. I want to get her. Yeah, Kimberly is safe. It's probably worth looking into this nice shawl business. <sighs> Cammy, they made it. They made it too, too much. <clears throat> nah, Cammy's redesign is peak. Peak. Peak in terms of redesigns. Gotcha, gotcha. Great. Who is that guy? JP? He's a... I don't even know if he's like the new villain of the game. He's sketch because he has, you know, psycho power and whatnot, but... Okay. I don't think it's been outright outed that he is a villain just yet. Because his game is lacking one, for sure. I don't, uh... I don't, uh... 
I don't know anything about Street Fighter War either. Like I'm not a like I'm not a big fighting game lore guy. It's the least complicated fighting game lore out there. I can tell you that. I think the most complicated. It's pretty is, straightforward, actually. I think the most complicated is Blaze Blue. You dive into the imaginary numbers bullshit. Blaze Blue can get wild. Guilty Gear is also pretty out there. Anything at times. by Arc Systems. Yeah. So this looks interesting. Uh, Metroidvania. That's what it looks like. Sick. Always a fan. Okay. Getting mad Hollow Knight vibes. Yeah. Except for, you know, more color. <laughs> yeah. Hollow Knight does the dark and green, but this is like, I'm gonna end up giving you a trip. Low key like a Hollow Knight slash oh, Rory yeah. mix. Yeah. Ultros. Hmm. I'm interested. I'm almost down for the Metroidvania. Yeah. Very underrated genre of gaming, in my opinion. Oh, yeah. I feel like more people need to delve into those. I mean, but there's also a lot of bad Metroidvanias out there. There are, there are some bad ones, sure. But, like, when they're great... They're fantastic. Like, actually peak of gaming. Oh, like, yeah. I mean, Hollow Knight. Uh, In my opinion, game. nothing out there really beats a great Metroidvania game. Like, perfect world games. That's pretty ambitious. <laughs> that's a confident name. Anime Met Girl. Oh. What is this? Xenoblade X2. Honkai Star Impact Third. Genshin the Kitchen. Punishing Grey Raven. Okay. Oh. Okay. Get back. Space Riding is so A single bike. And a multiple bike. <laughs> I forgot what the. Horse! <laughs> Robo Horse. Oh god, that was. Oh, it's an MMO. Oh, oh yep, it's a Genshin. Genshin Impact. It's a Genshin Impact, which was a breath but of the wild, which was next. It's got Meg, <laughs> so I'm interested. You throw a Meg in something else, player. Meg isn't enough to get me. I love Megs. But it's, it's a start. However, the fact that it is a Genshin yeah, has true. also dealt me out of me. It also is a, yeah, it's a Genshin. Like, I feel like I feel like we're gonna see like thirty billion more of these types of yeah. games, anime, open world RPG game. I played Genshin since Tower of Fantasy. Um, since about like I think the third update to the game. I played post release. I played the game when it launched, and then I dropped it like at level twenty. Yeah, I I made it to. I got, I got uh, the maid girl that everybody wanted. I made it to like AR Skyrim? fifty-four. Probably Monster Hunter. Yeah, definitely the Monster Hunter. Oh! Ooh! Dragon's Dogma 2? Oh. Okay! Alright! I've never been glad to be so wrong! Yo! Did you play Dragon's Dogma 1? I did. Of course. That begs the question. If he's a mere mama, then where might our true original Empress Nadinia's life is in your hands? Because he has many wares if you have the amount of times that I've I've um I've I've said the rope a rope bombs you want to get yours, my friend Zelda. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the more shoe. It crosses my mind every so now and like every so often. Even while just doing random things, I could just be like Ooh, it's got destructible environments. Sick. I could just be like getting some ice out of the fridge and just think to myself, Bombs? Whoops. <laughs> it's yours, my friend. It's yours, my friend. <laughs> I'm always saying that shit that it's yours, my friend. <laughs> I'm sorry, Link. I don't do credit. Come back when you're a little richer. It's like, bro, shut up, more you. <laughs> Welcome back for another week of career fulfillment Daddy. and minimal social interaction. <laughs>
I have one friend that tells me that's not funny. I'm like, this is pure comedy. Teddy is amazing. Shut your goddamn mouth. Teddy is perfect. Teddy Faye Bear. For that reason, we are excited to inform you that you did an adequate enough job the first time around to have you back. So, like, sister location remake? Maybe. Also, there were no other applicants. So strap yourself in and get motivated to an appropriate degree. Cause you ain't seen nothing yet. Okay. Oh, help on a DLC. Hmm. Oh! No, just a completely new game. Okay. okay cool. Nice. Yeah, that's... Mm. Nice. Classic, you know. Five yeah, Nights at Five Nights at Freddy's uh, mojo. FNAF, FNAF. MatPat's got to make another lore video. <laughs> or just help one and fit... Ooh! <laughs> MatPat. <laughs> help Pat needed. Or... Help needed. <laughs> help. That poor fucking man. That man has too much to do. Alright, PSVR 2 Not stuff. enough time. Oh, Resident Evil 4. What? Yeah, they were doing a P or VR 2 version of the game. So the remake is a VR version? Yep. Interesting. Yeah. That's like the one thing I think that, that is cool about the PlayStation is they actually have tried VR. I think other companies... If Nintendo with the with the sequel to the Switch yeah. doesn't do VR, because it's the perfect it's the perfect console for VR, literally, just put it in a thing, bam, you've got a VR game right there. Yeah, I mean, essentially, right? Like honestly, if Nintendo could capitalize on VR for the next version of the Switch, oh my God, it'd, it'd be uh, it'd be unstoppable. I just don't think Nintendo has an interest though. It's true. Like, because VR has been like kind of in the game for. I mean, Quite some done, time now. They've done some stuff with uh, the, the, the Labo. Yeah. The, like. Yeah, but that was like the only thing out of everything they could have been doing this whole time, you know? Yeah. And they did Breath of the Wild and, and, and Smash Brothers in VR, but that just amounted to you having a camera in your face. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I just don't think they're. I think. They're down I think with if it. Nintendo really went for it, they would. They would destroy the market. Oh, they would blow shit out of the water. They're just not down for it. Yeah. Vertigo Games, another PSVR 2 game. Oh, forgive me, Father. Or I've sinned. Um, like, a lot. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't see, really sound like you're sorry, though. Everything started two years ago when I met Fred. Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> Ever since then, it's like I see his face everywhere. And lately, I've started to develop some destructive tendencies. Whoosh! <laughs> what do we have here? Bro, uh, if they were brave, that would have been fun. Hello, ugly. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. And since I met my new best friend, I guess I get a little overprotective. Okay, very overprotective. I'd love to sit here all day. We're a little close to that. Off. Off. <laughs> yeah. I'll be right out, boy. <laughs> but as you know, time waits for no man. Get you later. Face, but... <laughs> Who's a good boy? Arizona sunshine over there. Like today is going to be good a enough scorch. to get a sequel. I guess so. I feel like Xbox could do VR too if they really wanted to. I'm surprised they haven't. Yeah, right? If it's you want to be honest. Or PSVR, Smilegate. Okay. Maybe they thought it was too close to like PlayStation 2 or something. Too soon. Yeah, I was about to say, it's look like Call of Duty. I want to get a VR headset, because they're, they're like, I want to play, like, uh, I want to play, uh, Avalon, or something, like, VR, uh, game, and that's what you can do, so you get, like, a couple of parents down, and then, uh, there's a mod for Minecraft in VR, and I played that on my friend's house, and that was fun. And I want to play Minecraft in <laughs> Crossfire Sierra Squad, okay. 
I know Crossfire. That's a pretty popular uh, free-to-play game. Mm. Interesting. Yeah. Well, you know me. The shooters aren't really my my jiggaloo, so... I know. I know. I, know. I wish it was so different, because I have so many friends who are into the shooters, and <laughs> I'm just like, I'm not part of that gang, man. I think I think you're... I think when it comes to shooters, you're probably a guy that likes uh, co-op experiences more so than multiplayer. Like left for dead. Intercepted comms chatter referring to neurosynaptic tech, but they've gone dark. Okay. I don't have to remind you. Long story short, they're in your head, man. Yeah. I mean, I'm surprised you haven't like you like Minecraft. Have you ever played Minecraft? It's connected I've delved to into two hours of Minecraft device. over the span of its release. Only two hours in the whole of Minecraft release. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so you've, you've what? You've, you've punched wood and you've maybe built a dirt house and that's all you've done? Build things? <laughs> no. <laughs> Yeah, just about. Oh, come on, man. Minecraft is one of those games I come back to for like a couple months. Hmm. Every time a new update comes out. Which is coming up soon, so I'm probably going to hit my Minecraft cycle here soon. Gotcha. In dreams. Impressive. Okay. I'll admit, you have a good team on the battlefield. Don't forget it. This is my battle. Alright, what is this, an arm rail shooter? <laughs> my I don't know. Then just dragging him across the floor is a little funny. <laughs> <laughs> the clock is ticking. You have to adapt. Yeah, like a running shooter. You have a path you want to reach. Or you would think like VR would actually be the king of on rails. But, um, yeah, right. I don't, a surprising lack of people have taken advantage of that, though. You know. Yeah. You would think that VR would be perfect for those old arcade games. Maybe. Yeah, like like a House of the Dead on real. Yeah, or a, bro, a House of the Dead in VR would be insane. Something along those lines, but no. <sighs> Beat Saber. Don't we can't stop. have this. Uh, this is having a good time. We got to do our own rendition. I enter the sky like a dragon. Don't stop, stop me now. I'm trying to avoid copyright. Stop me now. You need to stop this trailer. Please stop. Because I don't want to get copyright struck at all. I ran out of breath. <coughs> I don't think anybody's going to be ever better yeah. than Freddie Mercury. Freddie Mercury is a god when it comes to music. He is. <clears throat> I'll be honest, um, the VR games are cool. I just I don't have much interest in them right now. Yeah. Like, I want to get an Oculus just so I can play VR games, but that's about it. Green. 37. Green. You remember those, like, little electronic bug thingies? Oh, yeah, the ones that, like, you, you can, like, build them or something. Yeah. And, like, they just... Bungie. Oh. New game? I've never seen anything like this from Bungie, so maybe. Hmm. Oh shit, the liquid trees. Oh god. <laughs> and the heavens they are waiting? What? What is this? Mm. This looks interesting. This looks interesting. Something other than the Destiny? Yeah, uh, well, whoever that was, they are no more. Escape from Tarkov? That's a hurricane. Marathon! <gasps> no fucking way! Oh my god! Marathon is the game that Bungie was making before Halo. Really? Yeah. So this is like a return to form. And Destiny, of course. Yeah, well... It's kind of crazy how, how Sony now owns, Des now owns Bungie. Like, Bungie was the big premier Xbox like company and now now PlayStation owns where to begin. I mean, it's what happens when you drop the ball. <laughs> right. Long story short, somebody else is gonna pick it up. Yeah. With slain gods, 
that is <laughs> huh. I don't know anything about that snake. I don't know either. I played it for like a month with my friends because they all played I wish it. You could yeah. have been there. And that was all I ever put into it. I, I just was never too interested yeah, because too, again, you know. first person shooter. But hey. But I'm here now. I mean like when the game was being well, announced and like teased and everything, it looked it looked like Borderlands meets Halo. Mm -hmm. And that's what I wanted. But the gameplay is like it's it's menus the game. Mm. Like ninety percent of the game you're in menus. Eesh. And there are fans of Destiny like PlayStation it's Studios. Not, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It is. <laughs> like yeah. when I have to requeue for a raid for the chance to get one drop out of a raid, I'm, it's it's menus the game. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm not sitting through fucking 19 loading screens just because I have to redo a raid. Yeah, that sounds pretty disgusting. Yeah. Burger. That's a delicious looking burger too. It was pretty good. Concord. Concord. Why does it look like an old classic PlayStation logo? Yeah, it looked uh, like familiar, right? Yeah. <sighs> Would love to see some gameplay PlayStation. <laughs> yeah, something. <laughs> Haven't is. seen anything in a while. And I mean, I get it. Y'all are them, but come on. <laughs> the best Gran Turismo. Gran Turismo. Will compete for a place in racing history. What? Putting you in the car, my guy. I want one of those setups. Yeah, I, I really do. I want, I want like a setup like that. They look really fun. On it, like honestly, like there, there's ones I've seen where like they have these things where like the screen is just a big like encapsulating thing so it feels like you're really in the car like I would I would love one of those and some of have haptic feedback so like when this car like shakes it shakes your chair and stuff mm -hmm. I want I, I would love that <laughs> but they're like thousands upon thousands of dollars oh yeah absolutely I mean you're basically pretty much getting yourself like an arcade machine yeah an interactive arcade machine Gran Turismo based on a true story only in theaters, theaters. wait is that a movie Out of all the PlayStation games to make a movie about, Gran Turismo is not one of them. But Thank I would have thought. Us today. In that way, I'm like, Before back up, Sony, wait. <laughs> I have a few announcements to share. At PlayStation, innovation. You know, in superheroes are a big thing right now. If there was any time to make a Sony like, movie, movie <laughs> Infamous. Later this year, we will an Infamous movie would pop off. That enables you to stream any game from your PS5 console using remote play over Wi Fi. It's commonly known as Project Q. It has an 8-inch... That is not the final design. That is not the final design. No! Oh, God. No! Oh, no. ...our first ever PlayStation earbuds. What? will bring next generation audio immersion... I mean, Sony does know what they're doing with, with, with music. Yeah, with sound and audio, so this those, is good. Those could be top tier. A little over-designed, but good. Yeah, a little over-designed, yeah. But whatever the fuck that is in the middle... If they work on your PlayStation, that'd be cool. <laughs> whatever that is in the middle... I think it's a, I think it's a handheld they're doing. ...demonstrates our continued commitment to delivering experiences that surprise and delight our players. I want to thank all Surprise. Of you. I don't know about delight. <laughs> yeah, that's, surprise is right. Delight? Ah. You are swole, my guy. Yeah, that man is built like a brick house. What is your hair doing? Uh, yeah, I don't know what that hair is. Can I can I make a grip about character design? Yeah. Okay, I, I hate this modern trend. That's gross. You got herpes. Now. I hate this modern trend of we need a character to appear intimidating or, or you know, threatening or masculine. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to shave all the sides of their hair and give them a side part. <laughs> yeah, like, it's been it's been a male, thing for quite some time, female, ain't it? Whatever gender your character is, if you want them to appear threatening and physical, you give them that hairstyle. And it, I don't know. Yo, wait, is it? Is that Craven? 
Craven. Yeah, from uh, Spider Man. Is he Russian? And then the uncle? Well, that man is dead. Yeah, that. That man's arm looks weird. And this is what you find. You look a little bruised, Actually, my guy. Perhaps a new hunting ground. Oh, oh yeah, definitely. Spy Yo, the game exists. <laughs> it, it, it exists. Okay. It showed Deadpool and all them too. It did show Deadpool, didn't it? So is this is this a Spider Man game or a Marvel game? I mean I'm hoping this is Spider Man two and they're not announcing another Marvel game after not showing anything on Spider Man two. That'd be a little mm, stupid. Okay, Spider-Man. Yeah, Queen's Spider-Man. Okay. Cover the door. The beast could be anywhere. Damn. Oh. Okay, just right off the gate. <laughs> Venom symbiote. Okay. Interesting. Holy moly. Oh my god, that looks terrifying. What is the dog doing? Yeah. <laughs> the dog, what are you doing? Craven wants to hunt. I'll give him one he'll never forget. Damn. Hands rated E for everybody. So I mean Peter, you sound angry. Yeah. <laughs> Damn! What if he wanted kids? <laughs> He ain't gonna have them. <laughs> Fuck them kids. Fuck your chicken strips. I mean... That's a, that's a wide range of FM radio. Yeah. Switch to Miles. Damn, I was hoping they'd have a co-op thing going on, actually. Optional, at least. We don't have much time. Move. Uh, guess we'll chat later. You can have, hey, they have You can have the unadulterated swagger of a black team. <laughs> <laughs> All over again, boys. I that that article. Yeah, they turned Miles into Superman. <laughs> that article will always make me laugh. The unadulterated swagger of a black team. One of the great quotes <laughs> of all time. It's, <laughs> it's definitely a quote. Damn. Hmm. So wait, did they just like scrap Venom? Because Peter already has the symbiote. Maybe they separate the symbiote and then Venom comes in. Maybe. Was Venom in the first game? No, he was teased in the last bit of the first game to be connected to uh, Harry. Um, and then in the teaser trailer that they, or the announcement trailer for Spider-Man 2, that had Miles, Peter, and then Venom in like an alleyway. So like he was already like you know full body Venom. So yeah, they're probably gonna have you're probably gonna have Peter play as play with Venom for a little bit, and then you're gonna have to fight Venom. Yeah. But I don't know. This seems like this whole scenario would take place like mid story of the game, because like I said, like Peter doesn't know about the symbiote. Yeah, this looks like midpoint then. This is a weird showcase then, because <laughs> it's like. I, I've said this before and I'll say it again third person behind the shoulder camera I just don't get it man I wish they would do something more yeah like give it a bit more of a view range you know 
you're playing a Spider-Man game. I get this scene is supposed to be tense, but I don't know. It's just, eh. <laughs> you can have tension with an open camera. Dark Souls has done it. Batman Arkham Knight, you know, had the behind the shoulder. Like, games can do tension without it being over the shoulder. Yeah. But it's it's more cinematic this way, don't you know? Yeah, it's like I'm in a movie. It's more personal. It's like I'm really there. <laughs> no, being really there would be playing this in first person in VR. Skyrim is another game I want to play in VR. He sheds. He should, she shall, but the she shall. Does not mean he's getting bigger. Hungrier too. Oh, are y'all talking about lizard? Uh, Lizardman? Pete. Oh. In here. Any threats? The building's swarming with hunters. Any sign of Connor? Uh, yeah. Genki's tracking him. <laughs> Moses is like, Peter, I'm supposed to be black. This is bullshit. <laughs> but the date is incomplete. You're already the OG. Now you're taking my color too. <laughs> Damn. I think I got a lock. Wait, Appropriation at its worst. <laughs> at its finest. Some might argue. Look, man. <laughs> we're on a we're on a slippery slope to one day being able to swap everything about you. There's that dude that became Korean. He had so much surgery that he made himself look Korean. He even got his feet smaller. Bro, he's he, literally, he said he's trans Korean. Go, go, go! Take him alive! Transracial, transracial's next. Transracial's next. People, people, people joke about it. Oh, you know, blah, blah, blah. No, it's gonna be a thing. There are gonna be dudes out there getting themselves turned black. Christian. Yeah? As a black man. Yeah? I have to say. Yeah? Why the fuck would anybody want that? Like, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, but this is... <laughs> There's only one dude who wants to say the N-word. <laughs> he wants the free pass. <laughs> Bro, you're not getting it. You're not even getting the free pass. You're paid for DLC. All right? This, you got that fake pass, all right? That's the fake shit. <laughs> I paid for my pass, bro. I paid for my pass. And it's still not valid. I mean, come on. It's still not valid. So that's people who be, who are transracial, bro. Then then it's a real problem. Bro, this shit always happens to Spider-Man. Of course, there's got to be somebody running a sideshow while <laughs> shit hitting the fan. Can never catch a break. <laughs> Why is the military not involved in this? You have an un unidentified PMC mm -hmm. shooting shit in the middle of New York. Yeah, let me tell you, uh, New York has too many superheroes for the military to deal with this shit. Yeah. Like, New York has Spider-Man, well, Spider-Men, they have the Fantastic Four, <laughs> Avengers base is literally set up there, you know really? what I mean? So they have heroes left, right, and center coming in and out. It's just like, why? That's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> why waste the res resources? Oh, that's kind of cool, you can fly through the boat, or through the train. Stupid mother. Spider Man, hang on. That's awkward. What well, do you call each other? You're like, Spider Man, hold hang on, I got you. It's like, thanks, Spider Man. Spider Man. <laughs> spider Boy? Spider Person. Spider Guy. Why isn't why isn't there a Spider Girl? Spider Dude. Sp Sp spider Boy. <laughs> he was a Spider Boy. She says good you like her boy. <laughs> He was inspired enough for her. Just your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. A Do lizard not. chase scene? Do not. Oh my god. Of course. It's a, it's a crash bandicoot. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, this doesn't look that great. No, the water effects could be a little better. Yeah, this does not look that good. <laughs> Why is... Alright, so like, hear me out. If R Lizard is supposed to be just kind of going on this rampage, right? Why is he paying any mind to Miles when there's like so many other people? 
and things for him to just like carelessly fuck up, you know? It's just kind of not making sense. You know. He's ahead of him now, you know what I mean? Where are you going? See, that one made sense, because it's like making noise, making action, get it, you know? Yeah. But it's just like... <sighs> Boy, they put Miles to work. Yeah. Peter, why are you Spider-Man still, bro? <laughs> like, what have you been doing this whole time? Nice. Rest in peace? I don't know, just watching this footage, the game does not look that good. It, no, this doesn't really get me excited about the game. Like, not not, not even graphical, just gameplay. This game has looked very generic. Yeah. Looked a little basic B Spider-Man, and I mean... You gotta wait from us. I mean, Bro, it's Spider-Man. You it's can Spider -Man. get so creative and finessing with it, yeah. like, that that just... Like, if I'm being real, this looks like a... The, the gameplay looks like a Saints Row game. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a chase sequence and stuff like that. No, I, even the I open imagine... world, even the open world where he's flying through the city and he's playing, yeah. it looked like Saints Row gameplay. Well, the best part of playing, at least I had playing Spider-Man PS4, was you really um, had to feel like Spider-Man. Yeah, ignoring everything you were supposed to do <laughs> and just dicking around as Spider-Man. Like so the, I feel like that's the best fun of any open world game is just fucking about. Yeah. Like in, in Tears of the Kingdom I've been I've been building cars. <laughs> <laughs> Not even joking, bro. The cars are it's so fun to build stuff. PS5 Slim? No. I'm too good. Oh, uh, this is the end. They're doing a recap. Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, we're not gonna watch this whole recap. Yeah, okay. Okay, um so what did you think? Oh, so actually it was kinda of that long, that's crazy. Yeah. Um Well, I get why some people were disappointed. <laughs> yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, especially if you were a Spider-Man Two fan, waiting on something for Spider-Man, that just like what were the highlights? There was that. Uh, there was that F FPS Doom like spell singing game. Yeah, um, um, Immortals. Yeah, Immortals of some Avarum or something like that. That yeah. looked interesting. Um, um, let me think, because a lot God, of it there, was forgettable. Yeah, there, there wasn't was that a whole foam lot in stars there. that looked like it was kind of cool. Yeah, it's, it's not Splatoon. Yeah. Splatoon. Um, Square Enix Splatoon. Yeah. There's, I mean, I'm excited for Final Fantasy 16 still. Yeah, Final Fantasy 16. I mean, I don't know. I've just been out of Final Fantasy for a while. Like, the closest I get to Final Fantasy anymore is Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, there was that, there was that little one um, from Devolver. The, that the, was the flip book. And yeah, the, that one. That one looked good. That I one looked adorable. Don't remember the name, but yeah. that one's going to be frank one for me most certainly. Then there's the, the Metroidvania, the one with like Hollow Knight, but on acid. Yeah. That's a good uh, description, actually. Yeah. <laughs> acid Knight. Um, <laughs> mm. <laughs> sounds nutritious. Um, <laughs> fucking. But yeah, other than that, there wasn't anything that really swept me off my feet. No. Oh, well. <laughs> Fucking Metal Gear. Oh, Metal Gear. Metal okay. Gear Solid That's 3 Remake one. is definitely the highlight. That's the one thing. Yeah, I got drowned but... out by everything else that I almost forgot about. <laughs> so, like, here's my thing with that. So, it's it's a remake without Hideo. Yeah. So, like, are they just going to remake the games, or are they going to, like, actually continue with Metal Gear as a franchise without Hideo? I don't think they're going to continue without him. I mean, Metal Gear is a big cash cow for Konami. It's a cash cow, sure, but it's just, like... Hodel's touch <laughs> is kind of what also made Metal Gear. I, I can't imagine Metal Gear without Hodel Kojima. I mean, do you think they're going to change anything for the remakes? They probably will. I doubt they're going to keep it one-to-one. -one. I'm sorry. Yeah, they'll probably, like, change up a couple of things, but most of the beats and what it's mainly about, I don't I don't see them messing with Do you think they would, if they much. were to continue the series, do you think they would contract Hodel? Given all the things that happened between Konami and Hideo, possibly, maybe. I'm not gonna say it's out of the realm of possibility because, uh, especially as of recent, Konami has been um, remembering that they're a video game company. <laughs> so, I mean, Capcom and Konami have gone through really big revivals lately. Oh, absolutely! Like Capcom has been in cap god status for yeah. quite some time now 
Uh, it's good to they're see. on a roll, and it's yeah, good, it's, it's fantastic to see. to see. You love to see it. Um, and I mean, like I said, Konami's been kind of remembering that they're a video game company, yeah. and and they have games and that people beloved um, and all that stuff. So I feel like they, if they really wanted to, they might be able to work out something with Hideo Kojima to get them, uh, not maybe to fully come back and commit to the company, but yeah. to come back to these projects and um, have a hand in them. Pull up my opera real quick. So let me Google so we can see the list of things. Yeah. Um, but. Ghost gosh. Runner was a pretty big one. Yeah, Ghost Runner. Dragon's Dogma 2. Dragon's Dogma came from 2. out of nowhere as well. Um, State of that Madison. one game, what was it? Uh, Ghost Blade or something. Ghost Runner? No, it wasn't Ghost Runner. Phantom, Phantom Blade. <laughs> yeah, so it's an heck. I did forget it. Shit, you were right. Generic the game, the name, yeah. Yeah, Phantom Blade. I mean, it looked interesting enough to me. So, everything announced. So, um, Spider-Man 2, lengthy gameplay showcase. Uh, if you call it that. <laughs> I mean, it didn't look that it good, It was though. some gameplay showcase, some... Fucking Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater Remake. Which yeah. looks phenomenal. I'm excited for that. Y'all um, have to get David Hater dedica- back for oh, that, it's please. A, it's not even a handheld. It's a streaming handheld. You yikes. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ooh, yikes. Oh, man. That's That's, that's not good. That's so, not good at all. So this this right here, you know what this confirms? No one will ever enter the handheld space again. No. It is a Nintendo-only market. Yeah, y'all are trying to like dip your toes into it instead of trying to like fully commit. I mean, I would like That's to see another. I would like to see another PlayStation, VP, like PSP or Vita. You know, I'd like to see a PSP like two. No, I would love to see them take a crack at it. Don't fucking do it through streaming though. Like, because the issue, the issue <coughs> with the PSP, I think initially was, um, they they tried to focus too much. Like they, every time that PlayStation puts on a handheld, they focus on adding too much bullshit to it. Yeah, like the the Vita. They were like, it's got, it can have 3G, and here's all this cool shit you can do with this guy. It's like, who cares? Yeah. It's like... <sighs> well, because they feel the need of, instead of making something that runs great properly and functionally, and, you know, not too I mean, it ran, it ran great from what I understood. It's just they like to throw things in there, like the touch, the, the back touch Well, they, they think they have to compensate for it not being a console. Well, I mean, even still, like, with the PlayStation 4 and the PS5, like, I'm going to be honest, the touchpad, it's a gimmick. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't know why it's why they're still doing it. Like... It beats the hell out of me. I don't, like... So, so my thing with, like, controllers, and I have an Xbox Series X right here, and I have a, I have my, I have a plethora of Nintendo controllers. hmm This, like, the controller does not need to innovate to the point, like, where PlayStation is trying to take it, I think. Yeah. Like, the adaptive, adaptive triggers, that's cool. Like, th- that technology is cool. Rumble, cool. Stuff like that's fine. Hall Effect joysticks... Why does every company not use them? But, like, I don't need a touchpad in my game. <laughs> no. Like, and, and for God's sake, I'm surprised that Sony with the PS5 didn't put a back touchpad. Yeah. Like, that's been a thing they do, and I'm like, all right. I think it's, like, you know, the gimmicky uh, thing yeah. is trying to atta- attract maybe Nintendo fans, because, like, Nintendo yeah. is kind of the king of gimmicks. It's but true. It's true. The thing is, like I said, usually... With Nintendo's gimmicks, you know, as gimmicky as they can be, they usually put it at least enough thought for them to be yeah. utilized in a good majority of released games. Well, so that's the issue. Like, that's the issue with, like, the Sony stuff. Yeah. Sure, these features are cool, but not every game uses them. Yeah. And, and that's where you're getting hooked up on, hung up on. Yeah. You're getting to a point where, like, you're, you're making things, and you only have, like... If you're only if only your main titles are taking advantage of this feature, then why is it there? <laughs> yes, I mean, <laughs> like it's like the 3ds. Like a lot of games didn't take a lot uh, take advantage of the of the 3D. You know what they did? They made a 3ds list 3ds, yeah, a 2ds. Yeah, pretty much. Like it, it's just gimmicks are cool, but does it is it necessary? Does it sacrifice design? You know what I mean? And obviously with the PlayStation Five, they they found they found a good way to integrate that design. The, 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 the touchpad doesn't seem too out of place. It, it, it does look, you know, aesthetically pleasing. Um, and I'm sure functionally it works fine because I don't play the PlayStation that much. I just, I don't see the point of it in a grand majority of titles. Well, let me tell you, there is no point of it. 
Exactly. It's, it's, it is literally usually used as, if anything, in an emote shortcut tool yeah like, that's so, it like so. it, it is simply there to be yeah. there now so it's just a, it's just a way for them to separate the playstation control from the xbox that's all it is i don't even think it's that i just think they did it on the playstation 4 and then was like well we can't backtrack now for some weird reason they figured yeah. they couldn't uh, and then had it on the like PS5. like i said the xbox controller it, it's pretty much stayed the same for majority of its lifespan this shape i mean the, th- this is a series x so yeah. this is the newest version which if I'm being honest, in terms of hand feel, this is probably the most comfortable controller, in my opinion, on the market. In terms of hand feel. Yeah, debatable. Like, like holding it in my hand, my, my fingers, everything feels good. The control sticks have this nice amount of, you know, everything. D-pad's kind of poopy, but, like, triggers feel great. Bumpers feel great. Like, this is probably, in my opinion, like, the best designed general controller. <laughs> like... Yeah, but that thing right there, yeah, that screen, tablet, yeah. that's a failure. Uh, that, that is gonna, if that's not, if that is only, if that is any higher than like two hundred dollars, it's a flop. Like if this can't do more than just stream games, like if this needs to be, and I'm, I'm gonna say this now, this needs to be an Android tablet with PlayStation branding, PlayStation specific OS that you can access, but it's still an Android tablet that can do other things. Otherwise, this is going to fail. Nobody's well, going Well, the PlayStation it. itself can't really do other things besides play games. So, I doubt that's going to be the case. I mean, yeah. Uh, like, I'm, I'm sorry. that um, PlayStation, you tried it. Assassin's <laughs> Creed, uh, forgettable. Yeah. Alan Wake 2's hype. I do Alan like. Wake 2 was good. Uh, yeah, Final Fantasy 16, Dragon's Dogma 2, uh, Bungie, Marathon. I'm hyped for Marathon. I mean, Marathon's an old, an old Bungie. I mean, yeah. I didn't get to play it because that was before my time with with Bungie. Mm. Oh, poor baby. Oh, it's all right, son. Um, so I'm excited to see how this comes out. Um, Street Fighter Six looks uh, good as usual. Fair Games. How do you feel about this one? Like I said, I thought it was a couple of different games, and then it wasn't. And so I was just like, yeah. it's a big old we'll have to see. Yeah. Oh God. I didn't yeah, mean, we'll have I didn't to see. To the whole thing. Um, <coughs> PlayStation will have to see <coughs> gameplay, please. <Yeah. laughs> gameplay, please. Uh, Tell us Principle Two. I've never played the first one. Looks like a a, a fun game. Yeah. It looks Foam Stars enough. is a Splatoon like shooter. Yeah. Splatoon-like. Yeah. <laughs> From Square Enix. I mean, the character design is cool. I guess. Yeah, it's Gun decent. design is interesting. That looks crazy. Like I said, I mean, um, interesting oh, yeah. enough. Plucky Squire, that's what you're talking about. Plucky Squire. That's a frame one for you. Was one of the highlights Phantom for sure. Blade Zero literally looks like a... Like a. <sighs> like I said, it looked like a mix between Arkham and Dark Souls. Dark Souls and like I said, I I can be fine with that. I don't know. It, it, you know what it really reminded me of? Mm. Like, a, like a New Age Ninja Gaiden. Yeah. In a way. <laughs> Ghost Runner 2, that looks good. Uh, Hell Divers... <laughs> This one looks like a flop. Yeah, please just be free to play. <laughs> if it's not free to play, I'm gonna be disappointed. Yeah, if it's not free to play, then it's not going um, anywhere. Sword of the Sea. I'm, this one's this one's probably the one I'm gonna pick up the. the it was honest. interesting. It looked interesting. I loved the aesthetics of it. <laughs> Resident Evil Four VR. VR. We knew that Help was coming. Wanted Help Wanted Two was a surprise. I didn't yeah. know. Like I like I said, I thought it was Help Wanted DLC, but yeah. they're like two. And I'm like, uh, Risk Creator. Poor Matt uh, Pat. Neva. Rest in peace. This one looked... I like the art style. It looks pretty. I love the art style. I just also, again, wish I knew what the game was yeah. playing like. <laughs> uh, Cat Quest, Pirates of the Perbian. Looks like dumb fun. I yeah. enjoy the title. Hate cats. Um, but... <laughs> Towers of Agaspa, Breath, Breath of the Wild. Like, yeah, Breath of the Wild. I don't even know if that's fair to say, y'all. <laughs> We're coming out. It's 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 like dark. It's like Souls-like. We're now going to have Breath of the Wild-like. Yeah, Breath of the Wild-like. <laughs> it's... Oh, Jesus I mean, Christ. I mean, if I'm being realistic, what, after Breath of the Wild came out, everybody tried to do what Breath of the Wild did. Yeah, everybody tried to do it, but it doesn't... This one looks cute. I don't know what it's about, but it looks cute. Where like, I play? at least gotta say that that game was the least Breath of the Wild, like, a Breath of the Wild, like, game has looked. No, look, see, it's got the paraglider. It's totally Breath of the Wild. Oh, man. <laughs> You're a human that can walk around an open world. Fuck, of course it's Breath of the Wild. Grand Blue Fantasy, never played Grand Blue. Good to you. I've had my eyes on that one for a while, and I'm okay. hoping that it's great. Uh, Acid Knight, <laughs> Ultros, that one Ultros, looks good. Ultros, Churros. Um, Tower Fantasy, Genshin like. 
That's that's another coin term. Genshin like it had mechs, my guy. <laughs> that's I'm, what you said you I'm, wanted. I'm I'm gonna give it a shot. It's got mechs. I have to. Mechs, thighs, and all types uh, of eyes. Uh, P- PSVR, <laughs> Crossfire, Arizona Sunshine, Synapsis, and Beat Saber. Anything you feel about these? Yeah, I noticed they're missing the Gran Turismo movie. <laughs> um, Arizona Sunshine looks good. Um, I, that, that seems like a lot of Next, fun. I never even heard of it, but sure, have um, at it. I've never heard of it either, but it looks fun. Um, Concord, pff, that they showed they showed nothing. Yeah, a burger. The burger looked good. The burger looks good. Yeah. This Immortals of Avon. Yeah, yeah that this one looks good. Was. Pretty peaked interest so in this that. So this is multiplayer. It's going to come to Xbox, PC, and, and PS5. Got you. Okay. That looks good. I like it. Yeah, I, I need I, to I'm, see I'm more excited. of that. Yeah. I would I would like to see, like I said, in the trailer, it looked a little slow movement yeah. options-wise. I'd like to see more of that to, yeah, before for sure. I'm convinced. And that's everything. Yeah. Um, yeah, kind of mid. Uh, kind of mid? I, I'd say like <laughs> five. Five out of ten. It was kind of mid down the middle. I would say it had some highs, but those highs are what got it up to a five. Yeah, like, other I'd, than that, I'd say like five to six out of ten. Yeah, not yeah. not not high enough. Not high. And enough I even enough. feel like some of those highs came because like sometimes my monkey brain kicks in and I'm like I see game with like you know unique and and pretty sick art style. I'm into that shit. So Metal Gear remake. I'm into that shit. And then you know, um, there's a there's a flurry of nothingness after. It's yeah, just, you're not interested in it. I feel that. Yeah, like and then uh, at the same time, I got disappointed by what I saw from Spider Man. Yeah, I, and I yeah, Spider Man did not look great. I can't even <laughs> I say like I had something that I was specifically expecting to see. Yeah, but. So, like, you know, when I think back to even the first Spider-Man uh, trailer and even first Spider-Man gameplay of that, it's or even the Miles game. Morales expansion, it was just a lack of... It just felt like there was a lack of flair to it. It looked, it made it look super boring. Yeah, no, there, it, just, it felt it felt phoned in. Yeah, yeah, it felt like... Like, I, I mean, I know what I'm going to get from a Spider-Man game. But from the last two Spider-Man games that y'all have made and pushed out, at least what y'all shown from them was things that it wasn't. What's the word I'm looking for? It wasn't uh, generic. Yeah, it, it wasn't. It felt very generic Spider-Man. or bland or like it. Yeah, it's felt. It felt like a special type of Spider-Man. Like the only way Spider-Man can feel special. Yeah, you know. But we didn't get that with this. We got. We semi sort of kind of got that with like the initial announcement trailer, yeah. Because it's like, oh shit, Miles is here. Oh shit, Venom is here. We're about to get into some shit. Yeah. And then after a long ass time of not showing anything else on the game, you show us that, and then it's just like, this game doesn't even feel like it could be remotely magical or as magical as the first two. No. When when those beats hit, you know what I mean. Yeah. And like I said, they kind of showed an awkward point, you know, like middle of the game or, yeah. or, or something somewhat of it. I hope it's not like that's a, that's the beginning of the game. And then you have a flashback to before that sequence. If that's the beginning of the game, I, <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, yeah. No. overall kind of, kind of mid we're, we're doing a little something different. And officially, I think next episode after this one, we're officially going to have the new channel set up. Yes. For this specific kind of content, we're looking at doing other things other than just podcasts and reacting to this, um, which we're technically going to file this under podcast, but this is technically going to be part of reaction content that we'll, we'll have on the on other channel, the new channel. Yeah. Um, but we'll have gameplay, we'll have the podcast, and we'll have react. Whatever we feel like we can put out at the time. Um, it will be the collab channel. The collab channel. The group um, effort. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, officially, um, next week we will be uh, launching the Gamer Dad Buds YouTube channel. Yeah, actually. Yeah. Um, which will still host the Gamer Dad podcast, or Bodga- Bodcast, Gamer yeah. Dad Podcast, and then everything else encompassing the new the new, the new name and everything. So um, hopefully we can get things going. It'll be good. Yeah, hopefully um, you guys are looking oh, forward to that. Uh, 
Dang, that sounded like my daughter just fell off the roof. <laughs> so, <laughs> unfortunately, we have to go. So, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed, and hopefully, you you leave a comment on how you about, feel about the PlayStation event. I don't know. I, I felt kind of mid, but uh, hopefully, you guys can have some more insight on how you felt. That left me hangry. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what Xbox does. Hopefully, Xbox can have a cool showcase, and we'll react to that one too. Oh, well, after the last interview that I had Xbox had, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> maybe they're maybe they're gonna bring the heat. I'm hoping so, because right now, shit's looking kind of bleak. <laughs> <laughs> like, I actually thought, coming into this year of gaming, like... It wasn't going to be good? We're, we're just about to be skyrocketing in the shit. Nope, now we're, it's kind of starting off like we're this. Still, we're still like, cascading down a river. We haven't hit the waterfall yet. No, we, but, we um, have not. not that, that frightens me. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, as always, I am uh, one of your hosts, Shloob Goob. And uh, this was Ultimate Angelo. And uh, we thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next week. Son, you got anything to say? All right, y'all didn't hear it, but he farted in my hand. So, <laughs> what a what a perfect synopsis of that fucking showcase.